What's good everybody? Y'all already know who I am, but if you're new to the channel, my name is DJ and thank you so much for tuning in to the channel. So today I'm going to be doing my 2021 sneaker collection video. I wanted to wait until the end of December to do this, but I got picked up for a deployment. So I'm going to go ahead and get it out the way. So if you haven't checked out my 2020 collection video, I'll link it up here. It's either left or right side. I'll link it in one of these corners. Go ahead, check it out. Uh, drop a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, but let's get into this video. First pair of shoes, pair of Reeboks. The answers or the questions, sorry. Allen Iverson question, Bubba Chucks. Very unique shoe. Uh, paying homage to uh, AI. If you don't know, AI is a person that likes fishing. He loves fishing coming up. So they dedicated a shoe and designed a shoe, uh, you know, to resemble a fishing lure. Next shoe, you have the Adidas Ultra Boost Chinese New Year's. Very dope shoe. This is, I got these when uh, Ultra Boost were kicking. You know, these was reselling for like $500,000 you know coming coming through the days or whatever but i got these uh my favorite pair of ultra boots this y'all know what this is hold this very near dear to my heart um i love these 11 breads man this is a classic i actually doubled up on them too and these will be forever with me okay so don't ask about these 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 are mine forever next pair of shoes uh the acronym prestos the nike prestos very 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 comfortable shoe this is one of my favorite shoes when i want something comfortable and stylish at the same time i get stopped all the time when i wear these foam posit the yeezy uh colorway very dope um got these back in italy these sneakers were just sitting you know, they're more like into the, the, the trainers, like the Air Forces, everybody in Italy was rocking Air Forces. So shoes like that were just sitting on the shelf, which made it very easy, very simple for me to get shoes. So big ups to Italy for, for not liking dope shoes. Phone Posit Asteroid, Jordan 12, the Concord. Look at that, look at that purple. That purple shining, boy, I can't see it. I don't know if y'all can tell, but that purple is hidden. Of course, like uh, purple is my favorite color, so you know I had to get these. Next up, uh, the 14 Toros. I actually doubled up on these bad boys and got rid of the second pair. I got the cap and gown 11s. This shoe is disgusting in a good way. It's all black. It's crazy. I've worn this a couple times. Get compliments on this shoe all the time as well. All black 11. You can't go wrong with this. Uh, 72 tens, 11 72 tens. Uh, picked these up in Italy as well. Very easy to get. Like I said, was sitting on the shelf. So I should have got two pairs of these, but I only got one and uh, worn these a couple times. But 72 tens. Got the tumbled leather right there. Dope shoe. We got the Yeezy, the breads. Uh, I caught these on our restock um, during Yeezy day. Dead stock, haven't been worn. No lace swaps or anything like that. Uh, clean shoe. Uh, got a pair of Vans right here. Gotta have a pair of Vans. Next, we got the Jordan 10, Chicago uh, Broadway. 30th anniversary got these in Italy as well just sitting actually got these in a in the train station they had a foot lock in the train station went in there Valentine's Day bam came out with these boys I got the cinders easy 350 cinders uh, dead stock I did swap the laces uh, put reflective rope laces in there which brings out the shoe might I add, brings makes the shoe look 10 times better. These should come stock. Mm. Of course, you gotta have the, the zebras, you know, 
I mean, if you weren't able to get these, man, you weren't trying at all because these restocked about nine times. Easy, about nine times. So uh, nobody should have to pay uh, resale for these because like I said, they came, they dropped those a lot. Next shoe, Air Max 95, uh, the neon green joints, uh, 2020 pair. Uh, not too much to say about that. Old school, y'all know what it is. Got the Hirachi Trainers, Isle of Green joints. These things are light as a feather. I really enjoy these shoes. Uh, look, I've worn these uh, maybe twice to the gym um, and forgot I had them. Jordan 13 bread. These have been through the paces. I, they did, I got these in 2006 or 2008. Uh, one of those, but still in good condition you know uh the yeezy uh 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 static blacks are these the reflectives these are the reflectives i actually have the non-reflective as well so um this is the reflective pair got the metcons up tempo chicago up tempos only pair of up tempos i would like to get the olympic up tempos but right now these would do uh caught these on a restock or whatnot on foot locker clean shoe haven't worn them at all another one of my grills uh the sean watherspoon uh air maxes worn these a couple times very creative with this shoe this shoe is amazing to me uh you guys know y'all seen these shoes but it got the velcro tab Got the velour inside with the smiley on the inside. Y'all know what these are. Y'all know what the deal is with these. I have the clay, 350 clays. Another one of my personal favorites. Uh, that colorway is amazing. Uh, the Adidas ZX4000D. Uh, really don't know how I feel about these. Uh, I didn't realize how big or wide the uh, ankle support is. The ankle is crazy why like my skinny ankles is is too much room so unless i get a thicker ankle you know build them ankles up a little bit <laughs> i don't know how i'm gonna build them up but unless they get a little thicker they are gonna be staying in the box or i'm gonna be selling them uh adidas nmds when these were popping as well very clean very light uh, another Comfort pair bush. olive joints um olive black Worn these a couple of times as well. Very clean. Bread fours, y'all know what it is. I actually got these shoes off of somebody's feet. One thing with me is I'm gonna ask if this shoe looks good and I don't have them, I'm gonna ask about the shoe. I'm gonna try to get them off you, okay? But the guy said he had worn these once or twice. And as you can tell, pristine condition. Uh, I, I've actually worn these like three times, so the sole is a little dirty but all in all the shoes are clean i mean as you can ask for uh so maybe i'll make another video and tell y'all how i got them but just know i didn't pay for them okay just know that next uh got a pair of lebrons only pair of lebrons uh the lava i think these are the 10s these were my balling shoes I only these i've only seen the court uh didn't really rock those like talking about Next up, don't have to spend too much time on this. Y'all know what it is. Travis Scott, Nike Dunks. My only pair of Dunks that I have uh, will be added to those, uh, you know, eventually, but it's not, you know, exactly what I want right now. But next shoe, we got the Metcons. Uh, Nike Roche, very clean shoe, light shoe, very light shoe, running shoe. Very hard to keep clean. All white is very, very hard to keep clean. Got the uh, Chuck Taylors. Lows are my favorites. So I got the black, I got the red, and I got the whites. And I got the grays. These are dragon fruit, but these are Asics. Uh, if I would have known that this tongue was like this, I would have never got these. This is hideous, that split tongue. But they're supposed to, I guess, be easy to get on and off. But in my opinion, it kind of took away from the shoe because it, it really looks ugly. 
Air Max 90 in the turquoise color. Worn these a couple of times. Yeezy, the Quantum Bariums. Uh, I actually like these compared to the other ones. Uh, Yeezy 350 Frozen Yellow. I doubled up, actually tripled up on these. And I sold uh, both pair. So, yep, these have been around the world with me. Desert Sage, a Europe exclusive, I believe it was. Still dead stock. Uh, I did swap the laces. These are reflective laces, but these are made for this shoe. Next, you got the your kills. These are the reflective ones. I actually waited to get these because I didn't really know how I felt about them. When my homies had uh, hit and I saw them in hand and luckily they had a restock on these as well. So I went ahead and scooped these up, um, swapped the laces. Got the burgundy ones in there. The Yeez Reels, got that tennis tennis ball color again. Dead stock, didn't really do anything besides swap the laces. Nice. My favorite, my favorite pair of shoes. I love this pair of shoes. Oh, this shoe. This shoe is crazy. The uh, 13 Flints, I wasn't able to get these in high school, so I made sure I got these uh, when they came back out. Actually, I doubled up on these bad boys. I doubled up and that's another pair of shoes that are gonna be with me for ever. Jordan 11 Low, Legend Blues. My only pair of lows, uh, low 11s. This is gonna be my only pair of lows ever. Uh, I really don't rock with the lows too much, but these are, these are dope. Very good summer shoe, uh, all white and then that Legend Blue and then low cut, so it's a perfect summer shoe. Next, uh, Yeezy 700 Wave Runners, the dad shoe that everybody wants. Static Blacks, and this is the non-reflective pair. Uh, I think I showed you guys my, yeah, I think I showed you the, the reflective pair, but bam. Uh, triple Cream White uh, Yeezy 350s. This is my first pair of Yeezys. I actually got these from uh, Adidas UK and got my wrong size. The sizing is different there, so instead of a 10, I got 11. And good thing they run snug because I can still I can still wear them. Next, Jordan 1, UNC to Chicago's. Women exclusive, a must have. I had to have these. Uh, these women colorways are, are hard. I love what they're doing with the colorways, but they need to make them in men's as well. You feel me? Got the off-white. Uh, Metallic Gray Fives. Uh, rest in peace to Virgil Abloh. Uh, unexpected death. Uh, very surprising, he died of cancer. If you haven't heard already, but I'm pretty sure every sneakerhead knows that already. But either way, uh, rest in peace, condolences to the family. And I will be keeping all of my off-whites because you know how, how people are nowadays, man. They try to capitalize off of their man's death off of people death so uh, I'm pretty sure that the prices went up uh, higher but either way I will be keeping mine uh, forever so yeah more than one Travis Scott low this was uh, this is my actually my cheapest pair of shoes that I paid I paid 20 pounds to enter a sneaker raffle and I hit on these bad boys so Got these for 20 bucks, worn these a couple times. I actually like these better than the blue ones, in my honest opinion. I got the uh, Indigo 12s, only pair of 12s that I have in my collection as of now. I did have the Taxis and the Chinese New Year's at one time, but I sold those. I sold the Chinese New Year's and the other shoes were just beat. So uh, this is my only, actually, it's not my only pair of 12s. The Concord 12s. Got the Concord 12s and I got these as well. I got the Concord 8s, the 2007 pair. And these things, as you can tell, has, um, they've, they've been beats. Got the electric green 6s, the fire red denim, uh, the Japan exclusive, my boy over in Japan sent them to me. Next, we got the Game Royal 2.0s, uh, still dead stock. Haven't worn these at all. Biohacks, one of my favorite pair of Jordan 1s. The colorways is sick. 
Uh, I did my how to lace the Jordan 1 video with these, which has blown up, by the way. Uh, I appreciate everybody that's watched that video. If you haven't seen it already, I'll link it up in one of the corners. But either way, uh, I get a lot of questions on what shoes these are. These are the Biohacks, and I got the laces from Slickies. Uh, next shoe, Jordan 5 Alternate Grapes. Still don't know how to feel about these. When I got these in hand, I was kind of kind of disappointed. You know, I like purple, but I was kind of disappointed in these. And I think I still am. Don't know what I'm going to do with them, but um, yeah. My red with the fives. Of course, you guys know they took all the five colorways and mixed everything together. And this is the come out. Um, this is my first pair that I got from sneakers. I got exclusive access on those and I haven't gotten it ever again. So um, that was probably my one and done. Uh, these are 2020 Fire Red Fives. Uh, worn these one time. You guys know what the deal is with these. Uh, still super clean. Uh, no yellowing whatsoever. The British khaki uh, sixes. The Travis Scott sixes. Uh, I have the OG ones as well. I prefer the OGs, but um, the uh, the little details that they put on this shoe, I wish they would have put on the OGs. I really like that, like the details in this shoe. But like I said, I still prefer the olive green joints. The MP, um, black and gold. Worn these a few times. Everything is still looking good. Can't lose with the black and gold. My only pair of nines that I have, probably will be the only pair of nines that I have, unless I get the olive. The olive joints are tough, so if I get those, uh, I'll be happy. This pair will probably get sold. Probably won't even get my money back on those. Um, it is what it is. Next shoe, got the crimson tint. Crim crimson tint, worn these a couple of times, as you can tell. That pink. It's fire, black and pink, fire. Very clean shoe. I have the Court Purple 2.0s. Swap the laces out. I've worn these a couple times. Put the white laces instead. They came with black and another pair, but looks a lot cleaner with the, the white. I have the What the Fours. A shoe that was very, 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 very slept on. These went to outlets. These sat on shelves. Actually, I think they went below retail for a little while, but then a couple months later, they jumped up in resale. People finally realized what they skipped out on, but I really like this shoe, very good quality. I think this was my first, the shoe I did my first, first, first video on for this channel. Uh, the black and metallic uh, Jordan 1s. Only thing I don't like is the patent leather. So more than likely, I'll be getting rid of these. I really didn't want these from Jump. I entered a raffle. And like I always do, I hit on the stuff that I don't really want. The Jordan 4 Sashikos, very, very unique shoe. Um, if you can tell, if you see like the patterns and stuff, a very detailed, very detailed shoe. They took their time with creating this shoe and more than likely you won't see nothing else like this ever again. So this is one of my favorite pair of fours as well due to the detail and will more than likely be my Christmas time shoe. Next, Jordan 6 Bordeaux. As you guys know, Bordeaux came out on the 7, 7 silhouette first. But in my honest opinion, this colorway looks a whole lot better on the 6s. Just my honest opinion. I've worn these a couple times, still look good. Well, actually one time. I did a video on these as well. So if you haven't seen that, uh, go check it out. I have the other pair of the fire red denims. Uh, the second pair. I doubled up on these second pair. I gave away for my 1,000 sub giveaway. So uh, that went to my subscribers. Very, very clean shoe in my opinion. I really like those shoes. A lot of people slept on those as well. So it doesn't matter to me because I got them. But fine green 2.0s, doubled up on these as well my wife has a pair as well taupe haze the fours taupe haze fours uh, i didn't really care for these at well actually when i first saw them i really wanted these but i didn't know about the crack leather 
If I would have known about the cracked leather, I, more than likely I wouldn't have got them. But it's a very unique shoe because it has an overlay or underlay under the, the leather part. So the more you wear them, the uh, more the underlay will show. But I'm pretty sure some people on YouTube have like the, the part scraped off or whatever so you can see. But I haven't worn mine enough for it to scrape off. So I'll see them eventually. I'll see it eventually. No rush, no rush. Then I have the Winterize 4s. Worn these one time in England, in the rain, in the cold. And I must say that the fleece on the inside does its job. My feet were sweating. They're meant to be worn in the cold and the weather and stuff like that. Uh, next, I have the Jordan 6, the uh, Travis Scott 6s. Dead stock, haven't worn these at all. Still brand new. The only thing I've done is swap the laces so very clean shoe and i prefer these over the british khakis like i said before next the lightning fours had to have these first came out in 2006 i didn't have any money for these but now i can get these shoes so i got them i actually gave up my jubilees traded my jubilees for these um they were just sitting, really didn't plan on. I didn't want them from jump, but I got them under retail. So I sold these, I, oh, not sold them, I traded them to get the Lightning Fours. And I'm glad I did. These joints are dope. I did my how to lace uh, the Jordan 4 video on these. If you haven't seen that, I'll link that up as well. So go check that out. Next, I got the Off-White Fives. Of course, I had the metallic ones, the OG ones. So I had to get these. I've worn these a couple of times. I really didn't know how to feel about the aged look on the pictures, but when I got these in hand, these, I mean, it's not bad. Very, very dope. Uh, everybody has their own opinion on which ones is better, but I really prefer the uh, metallic ones better, but these are dope too. And the last pair of shoes I have, the women's exclusive, the Rasta, the Jordan 4s, women exclusive. If you know me, if you've been around for a minute, you know I'm real heavy into reggae. So, I had to have these. Women exclusive. The only thing I don't like is the see-through plastic. Really don't like that, but it didn't push me, you know, not to get these. Still dead stock, haven't worn them, but I will. Like I said, with every one of my shoes. And that's my last pair of shoes, man. If you like the video, throw a like on the video. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I hope everybody was able to get those cool grades as well. I was able to cop on Champs, so I will be doing a video, hopefully. Until the next video, peace.